hello and very warm welcome to swift tutorials in today's video we are going to learn how to animate constraints or ms layout constraints while using auto layout in our ios app development so just start open up create a new xcode project single view app and name it animate layout constraints language will be swift and we will save it to our hard drive and here xcode presents single view application template so now for this tutorial we will create a basic login page or sign up page you can say and so that let's create first our ui and then for the So here we have our screen and we will place our controls at the bottom so just first place a UI view here and we will change the background color to little gray color here it is and we will create a view we will place it 20 pixel bleeding 20 trailing and 10 from bottom okay so now at this moment it's giving error that its height of is not defined so here need by position means it has by position but it's not in the, uh, accountable so here it say add missing constant for view because we don't have height so it doesn't calculate how much long it will stretch so now for this first we will drag a UI text field here and we will give it constant 10 for leading 20 from top and 10 trailing and height will be 50 where we add now now we again add one more field and we will place it 20 pixels from the web text field and 10 from the super view 10 from here and we will give it Height 50 and yeah we will give it a bottom so that all things gets calculated so here you can see now all the things are cleared let's give it a color green color and a text field of white so let's make it um, this color it's not looking good so here you can see we create our sign up you can say email and password field email address and we will set the keyboard type to email and correction no capitalization none okay and here we will say it's password password and here we will say make it a secure entry and turn key will be go so that now at this moment if we run our app on iphone 10 simulator then it 
and then you are seeing a normal view with two text fields so now in order to animate it let's go to the coding part first we will create an IB outlet for our bottom constraints week where view container v for bottom and c for constraint is of type ns layout constraint and here we will open up our main door storyboard and click on this view and here in the bottom we will select the constraints and here new referencing outlet and we'll drag and drop this here and connect this to view container bc that is the bottom constraints open up your view controller dot swift and here first we'll set self dot view controller vc there is property called constant and here we say minus ui screen dot main dot bounce dot size dot height and then we will do now this line will what it does it makes the value of the bottom constraint that is currently you can see here this is currently 10 this value 10 so we will make it negative so that it goes down and here you have self dot perform selector with object and after delay so here we say has selector we say bring up view object will be nil and time will be 0.3 seconds and in swift for we have to append a directory of gc and then function keyboard and then we will call this bring view up function name and double brackets and then here so here we will say ui view dot animate with duration 1.0 and here and here we will set dot vw dot dot constant is equals to 10 that is our original value now if you are thinking that this is done and our view will be animated then it's not done yet you can see it's right here i am running the code now <coughs> i'm sorry so here you can see no animation so to animate it we need to do one line of code more self dot view dot layout if needed okay and then it's ready to go so here you can see now it's animating and coming from the bottom of the screen there you go you can change the animation duration here and suppose i make it 2.0 and just make it for also for the betterment make another iv outlet for our view controller with that iv outlet week where vw container of type ui view and let's connect this view to our view container and here we will make its self dot vw container dot layer dot corner radius is equals to 10.0 and let's go so here you can see a nice little view and it's looking nice it's coming from the bottom screen 
this is quite slow we will make it 1.8 and now so the duration of the animation you can set it according to your need and here you can see a beautiful animation that brings your login fields to you from the bottom so in this way you can animate layout that are built with auto layout in iOS using Swift you need to set constraints dot constant values and then you have to call the layout if needed function so that it will redraw the layout and thus animate your constants constant and thus provides you a beautiful animation to your views so if you have any question then please feel free to comment and if you like this video then please do share this video and give a thumbs up to this video and please subscribe to our channel so that you can get future updates for our new future release in our next video we will cover that how we can animate these fields while keyboard is pressed keyboard is seen or user start typing on those text fields thanks for watching bye for now